Hi, welcome back to Outdoor Gear and Skills. Uh, yesterday I was over at Umqua Survival here in Roseburg, Oregon, and Carlos gave me this Blackbeard fire starter to try. Um, and it's just wound like a rope. Uh, it's fire starting, it's supposed to be windproof, waterproof. Uh, if you're in the area in Roseburg, go stop by and check them out. They've got some great stuff in there. So I already cut a, a portion of this off and it's wound just like rope. And so you're supposed to just take it and kind of roll it around and, you know, open it up, make it kind of like a nest, you know, like you would. So it is, uh, you know, really flammable. If I just use a lighter, you know, you'll see that it lights up really easily and uh, starts going. So that, uh, that's nice on it. So the issue is that we've been using this fire striker. And that shows off some pretty good sparks. But trying to get this to go with a fire striker, you know, it's not just going. And I know it's not the fire striker. And the reason I know that is I just grabbed some dryer lint, which I really like to use because it goes uh, really quickly. So there it's starting to go. So a couple strikes and I got the sparks in the right spot and it burned right up. Now dryer lint is not waterproof. So that's one of the things you've got to keep in a container. I usually keep it in a pill bottle container and that way I can just keep it, you know, nice and I can pack it down really tight. So I've got a lot in there. The advantage to this would be that it's waterproof. The disadvantage is I can't get this going with a striker. So again, if I just take my lighter, you know, that stuff just goes right up. So when I'm kind of looking at that, you know, I, I like that it's bound in the plastic so I can just kind of keep it from coming apart uh, because it is wound like rope. Uh, and all that, and I don't want it to come apart and, and fray on its own. So that part's pretty nice. Being waterproof is nice. But so far, I've tried two different fire striking systems. I'm giving off a lot of spark, and that's just not going. So I'm going to give it a few more tries, but what I'm looking at is if I have that, I'd better have a lighter with me, or I'm not getting a, a fire going. And again, just looking at the ease of using dryer lint, uh, there's a, a big difference in how effective it is starting a fire. Let's actually get that out of the way. We don't need to throw sparks at a lighter. So it wants to go and it kind of sparks up, but it's not going. And again, You know, this versus, let's get it back on my good striking edge. That's not going. Several, and I just can't get that to go, but I can get that going. So, so I let that burn, I'll throw more strikes on here. So again, I love the idea, I love the pirate theme. I love their website, um, Blackbeard Fire Starters. Um, it was really um, good, but I've tried for several minutes now. Can't get it to go with a fire striker. For me, you're not always gonna have a lighter. And if that's what you rely on when you're in a potential fire situation, it can run out of butane. Some of the parts can break. If that's all you've got, in fact, this one's almost gone. If that's all you've got, you know, that's really not something I just want to trust on. I've said it many times, I don't like being cold today. You can kind of see my breath. It's kind of a cold day. I like things that allow me to use a fire striker to get a fire going. Now, I always have a lighter just as, you know, kind of a backup in my stuff, but I don't want to rely on that. With this fire striker, I can get cotton balls dipped in Vaseline. I can get dryer lint going, but we're just not getting this to go. We've tried different angles, tried getting, you know, further back here, throwing the spark, trying to get closer up here. 
and it kind of sparks it wants to but it's just not going um, great thing for me to try but for ten dollars honestly I don't know that I would even bother with that unless you want to make sure to pair it with a, a brand new lighter and keep it uh, together so it's protected thanks for watching let me know if you've tried this out let me know if you have any comments and uh, have a great day